Hi Coding Ninjas! In this tutorial, we'll dive into creating a custom cursor for a web page using HTML and CSS. You can find custom cursor PNG files online, and choose one that suits your style. Now, let's get to the code. First, I'll add a simple heading to fill up the page. Alright, let's move on to the main part. In our CSS, we'll target the entire HTML document to change the cursor appearance using the cursor property. We'll specify the path or name of the image file we want to use. Let me show you mine. Remember, your image file should be saved in the same folder as your HTML file. The image should ideally be small in size to avoid overwhelming the screen. Mine is approximately 41 into 50 pixels. The auto value ensures that if the specified image fails to load, the browser defaults to a standard cursor style. And that's it. We're done. Happy coding, and don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials.